Let's bring in Lonnie Quinn now, chief weathercaster at WCBS-TV in New York. All right, Lonnie, the big questions now, when and where will Barry come ashore? Okay, I believe it's going to be west of New Orleans. I think it's going to be tomorrow sometime in the first half of the day. If I had to pick an hour, I would say like around 7 a.m. or so, give or take. Here's the latest information. So it's gotten stronger. We now have winds at 65 miles per hour. This time yesterday, if you were with me, they were blowing at 50 miles per hour. I think it makes landfall with winds anywhere from 70 to 80. 70 is a tropical storm, 80 a low-grade hurricane, and then it sort of pushes inland a lot of water. Okay, a lot of water is going to fall with it. It's going to come from a number of sources. Okay, out of the sky, the rain. You've also got some storm surge. Now, look at this. All right, this is the worst situation right now because as it spins out there, it's pushing all this water into, that's the mouth of the Mississippi River. So that water in an already swollen Mississippi can't flow into the Gulf. It's kind of plugged up with a, a cork in it, if you will. So that continues to rise. It's already risen today about a half a foot more than where it's already been. And it's so high already before the storm even gets here. How much rain do we see? It's this black area shaded just to the west of New Orleans could see two feet or more of rain. So look like the officials were saying in New Orleans, we always knew this was going to be a storm about the water, not necessarily the wind. Kim, let's go over to you. Not a pretty picture, Lon. Thank you.